Hi year four, I hope you're all okay and that you've had um, a lovely weekend. Um, I can't believe that I'm here to talk through the final week of home learning or school learning, depending on, depending on where you are today. Um, 14 weeks of learning. Wow, um, some of you have been at home for, for nearly four months and others of you have been at home for most of that time and you've re returned to school for the last few weeks. It's un unbelievable really. Um, that this is how year four has been. Um, but we have seen so many children in year four demonstrate all of their core values over the last few weeks and we're incredibly proud of you. It is soon time to find out who your year five teacher is. Keep an eye on the website this week and there'll be a little video um, letting you know and you will be receiving your reports from us this week too and a little letter from your teachers. So look out for those in the post. Okay, so last week and the learning, writing, Mission Possible is coming to an end. You have had um, four weeks, three weeks um, on this unit and um, it's time for you to write your own stories. So Monday is a final planning day. You're going to summarise each of your paragraphs and then for the rest of the week, you're going to be writing and publishing your spy stories. And we can't wait to see what you um, come up with. So don't forget to email them so we can read them. In reading, I'm not going to tell you the genre. I'm just going to tell you the theme. The theme is witches. And from that, you'll be able to tell whether it's fiction or non-fiction, I hope. But um, I'm not going to tell you any more than that. It's a really nice little week for the final week of reading. Math. You're going to continue using your um, purple book and you are working on more decimals. You're going to be writing, comparing, ordering and rounding decimals from Monday to Thursday. This is new learning. You've been trying so hard with it. Those of you that emailed you, your work to us last week have done really well with this. So keep using the slides and the um, website to help you. And then Friday and maths is a challenge day. And there's two project lessons this week. The first one is a roundup of all the project lessons you have done during the time that school has been closed or um, over the last few weeks. So if you think back, you've done art lessons, D&T, where you had to make an instrument, you've had science, lots and lots of geography. So we want you to think about all of the wider curriculum subjects and evaluate um, your learning. So you're going to summarise what you've learned in those subjects and choose your favourite overall lesson of the whole time um, that you've been um, home learning or for that, from the last few weeks, those of you that have been in school as well. The last project lesson is a fact file. You're going to write about yourself as a person right now at this time in 2020. We've all been through a really strange few weeks. A pandemic is not something that happens um, often. It's the only time it's ever happened in my lifetime. And um, you are going to write about yourself, what you look like, your favourite things, so that when you look back on this time, you really remember the person that you um, are, that you were. My children have done this and we've put it in a little scrapbook um, and we'll keep it for a long time so when they're grown-ups we can look back at the pe people that they were during this time. So um, two project lessons and that's reading, writing and maths. Those of you that are in school really enjoy your last few days, you're only in Monday to Thursday and those of you who are at home make sure you keep doing your home learning for the last few days and then come um, next weekend it will be um, the summer holidays and you'll be um, thinking about getting ready to come back and be in year five in September. So have an amazing summer, make memories with your family, stay safe, make sure you read, read lots over the summer um, and have a lovely time. Stay safe and we can't wait to see you all in September. Everyone will be back at school in September. You'll be in your year five classes, but we'll be able to um, see you and give you a wave and there'll be air hugs um, galore. Um, have a lovely summer and take care. Bye.